Antoine just got a lot of crap in the mail and we're gonna unbox it to find out what's inside. Alright, I'm gonna get some tape so I can hide my address just in case some of you wants to steal my shit. So let's do it. All right, let's start with the mount. Uh, it's 45 pounds. This is the Atlas EQG. And it holds about 40 pounds in max. All right, let's see what's inside. Uh, Another box. Wait. There's two tiny boxes. I think this is the weights. <laughs> it's pretty heavy. Oh, uh, let's, let's open this one here. Yep, this is enough. <laughs> uh, let's see. I kind of want to show you what's inside. Um, so here's what it looks like inside. So let's open this. I'm guessing this is um, the weights and the hand controller. So let's see. Careful. Okay. Uh, definitely weights. Okay, that's, so weights are supposed to be two weights. Yep. No, Together. this is just one, I think. Then those. Okay, open this one. That's super heavy. Oh. Oh, no. Okay, okay, so actually, okay, so the mount comes in two packages. I'm getting the other one tomorrow, so this is the first package. That's only the base and the weights. And I'm guessing the package tomorrow will be the hand controller and the, the motor. Okay, then. I'm guessing you can power the telescope and uh, the mount. So I'll show you all together tomorrow when everything is here. Okay, now let's do the all the accessories. I think there's like eight in there. So wait, let me get this. All right, so let's see. Wait, what is this one? This is the auto gather. Wait, let me focus. Alright, so I got the, the mini auto guider. So there is this guide scope and the actual camera, which is opening right now. Hmm, interesting. The weird box. Open it. It's weird. Okay, that's the camera, which we have to be very careful about because this is not protected. Alright, this is a camera, which will guide the stars. This is a small uh, guidance um, yeah, guide scope. I got the small one because it's less heavy than the, the big one. And who says less heavy says more tracking. Nice one. 
I show you right now like this, but um, tomorrow I will put everything together on the mount. So this is just an overview. Bare pieces. Okay, put everything back. And now I got all these tiny parts, so let's see. We have T ring, I think. Yeah, this is a T ring for the camera. So this T ring plus where's the let's see. Plus this thing, yeah, this thing here. They go together to attach the camera to the scope. And then this is what? Oh, this is an eyepiece. I got an eyepiece, um, 25 millimeter, which doesn't come with a mount, with a um, scope, so I had to buy a new one. It's just a plus also, it's a cheap one, so I hope it's still good. Then here we have the coma corrector, because with the astrograph, since it's uh, f3.9, you will need a coma corrector, or else your stars are gonna look weird especially your edges. And then last part in this accessories box is the uh, collimation, which is going to be very annoying for me because with this scope you're going to do it like every time. So you're going to collimate the scope like every single time you use it. Thank you. And I bought the laser collimator because the told me it was like, don't break my stuff. <laughs> I'm not well, trying to. <laughs> See, it's not that easy. Damn, what the f- <laughs> Oh, there's a there's tape. Smart. Okay. Gilbert? <sighs> Alright, this is a laser. So I'm, this goes instead of the eyepiece. And it shoots a laser. I'm guessing the battery is already in there. I'm not sure. Yep. Look, yeah. So this laser, you gotta make it bounce against the mirrors and once everything is perfect, it's gonna hit the mirror over there. But I'll show you maybe later. Alright, so all the accessories are done. Let's actually uh, open the scope. Okay, how right, this I'm scared to use the scissors. I'm gonna do it on the edges. Okay, that's two boxes. Um, let's just Just on the edges, not in the middle. Alright, let me show you what's inside. Finally, that's what it looks like inside. Do you want to see the camera? I'm guessing. Okay, let's get what this is. I have no idea. I'm guessing this is either. Okay, that's the eyepiece, I think. Adapter. That's a fan. This is what. Uh, that's for the guiding stuff, I'm sure. Yeah, that's for the guiding. Uh, I mean the the spotting stuff. I have no idea what this is. Let me show this. There's, there's two of those. I have no idea what this is. That's the dovetail to attach whatever. And then this is what? What is this? Oh, finder scope. This is a finder scope, which I heard bad things about for some people and some very good things about for some other people, so I have no idea. So let's see, this is good. I think it's 15 mm, I'm not sure. All right, and now let's get the scope itself. Wait, this is what? Let's see what it says. Yeah, there's so many parts, it's crazy. Scaffolding. I just don't know which way to open it. This way, I guess. Where is this? Oh, this is the uh, rings, okay. Oh, this way, I'm just do it there. There's all the rings that go around the scope. 
That's a good protection, as you can see. Good luck. Yeah, you can see now. All right, so we have the hand controller here. Pretty big, more than I thought. Put this. That's for the. That's to hold the controller, I think. Some cables for the computer. Some tools. Yeah. Some more tools. And then the actual huge motor. It's pretty huge. So now I'm gonna try to put everything together on the mount, which is here. And we'll try to see if it works. So wish me luck. Ah, that is so creepy. So this is done, here is how it looks like. I couldn't mount the camera yet because um, the tearing I have is not working. So I'm waiting for a new one. But um, yeah, the, the mount is perfectly done now. Um, this is the power, it's working perfectly. And let's try to, to find an object. So I asked her to put M31. So go ahead, press enter. Oh, it's working. Perfect. So it's pretty quiet. And seems like it's working fine. I just put like uh, two star alignment. Completely random, because obviously I can't see the stars from here. Since it's in my living room. But um, yeah, so I'm pretty happy. I can't wait to, to get some imaging done. Do you think it's cool? <laughs> anyway, so yeah, bye and thank you for watching. <laughs>